looks strange. Hello, my lovely Elena Skiller peeps. As you see, I have my copper suit on and I have, I usually wear scrubs too, but as you know, the AC and the she shed is broken. So it's um got a fan going, so it's bearable, but we're going to have to get a whole new AC system in there in that little tiny shed uh, Wednesday. So that's good. That's it's Friday today. I do wear my copper gloves and I wear copper bracelets and copper, a, a bunch of Herkimer diamond bracelets as well. In case you want to know. I found out something quite interesting today or yesterday. You know, I really try to pour love into the scalar field, into the person who I'm working on their energy. And sometimes I will use visions of my love, Eric, or one of my other kids, et cetera. And, um, you know, it's it's kind of hard for me to, to see anything of Eric unless it's a photograph or a video. I can't really remember anything about him. And that's strange. I think it has to do with trauma, um, supposedly. But so I always sing, sing the song to all my children, and you guys probably do it too. It goes like this mama mama and i'm rocking the mama love the little baby eric then i go to christina 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 loves the little baby eric i love you too okay i don't think she likes my singing taylor don't be a critic don't be a critic no ah, 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 ah. you must thanking so anyway when i when i and i've got the 528 hertz tone um, yeah, Hertz tone playing really loudly. And the voice, when I go, mama, kind of makes this resonating sound, this weird, cool feeling in my body. And so I asked the divine team, it's like, do I, you want me to use this vocalization this in, in the 528 Hertz tone? I mean, will that help? And they said, yes, it will. So now I will, you know, uh, well, let me give you an example because I kind of want to do two, kill two birds with one stone. I, I'm trying um, to see if we can help motion sickness. And so this will give you an opportunity also to understand how complicated the physiology of things are and how important it is to have, you know, considerable medical knowledge uh, when writing these scripts. And this is a script for for um yeah for motion sickness as long i'm going to read you part i don't want to bore you but i would start out with let me see <clears throat> um eh, uh, let me say jane doe jane doe is in me uh, mama I, I do that every oh jane doe is immediately and permanently and completely freed from and cured of motion sickness. And then I'll just do it in the regular tone. So you just, I, I won't make a fool of myself. The vestibular system in, in Jane Doe, I'm going to say people's names, is immediately and permanently and completely in its pristine and ideal and perfected state. The vestibular, it gets crazy. The vestibular system in uh, so-and-so is immediately and permanently and completely in its pristine and ideal and perfected state of functioning. The input from the proprioceptive and vestibular and visual senses in the physical body of so-and-so is immediately and permanently and completely in ideal and perfect synchrony. So-and-so is immediately and permanently and completely freed from and cured of vertigo. So-and-so is immediately and permanently and completely freed from and cured of vestibular pathology. Oh, I like this one. So-and-so, I feel sorry for that so-and-so, I hope they get over their motion sickness, is immediately and permanently and completely freed from and cured of sensory conflict. So-and-so is immediately and permanently and completely freed from and cured of neural mismatch. So-and-so is immediately and permanently and completely freed from, I say it slower, Freed from and cured of nausea. So and so is immediately, no, immediately and permanently and completely has complete postural stability. So and so immediately and permanently and completely has complete symmetry of the otolith organs. You know, the usual people won't, I mean, non doctors, I can't imagine, or non healthcare providers. Okay, so and so is immediately and permanently and completely, let me just read a little bit more. 
completely freed from and cured of disinhibition of the vestibular cere cerebellum. I'll do two more. Um, so and so immediately and permanently and completely has no discrepancy between actual versus expected patterns of vestibular and visual and kinesthetic inputs. One more. The expression of genes that contribute to, I do this a lot with genes on everything I do. The expression of genes that contribute to motion sickness is immediately and permanently completely blocked in the physical body of so-and-so. So, -so. so um, that just shows you some of the ways I write scripts. Oh, my computer has jelly on it. Uh-oh. And, um, but here's another cool thing. When I'm saying these things like, la, 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 la. If I'm not, if I'm right on the tone I should be at, there is smoke everywhere and nothing's on fire. And it's not my breath because it's hot as crap in there because of the AC problem. So, uh, and then when I get a little off, a little too low or a little too high, the smoke goes away, the vapor goes away. So I think that's really cool, really. And uh, let's see what else do I want to tell you. Hmm. Oh, yes. I think I'm going to add an interesting thing to everyone's script, and that is something that tells the higher self or the person themselves, the life form, even animals, to heal themselves, to contribute to the healing. Heal yourself. You can heal yourself. So I'm going to have to figure out and, and converse with Eric on exactly what the wording should be. But I think that's going to be a very helpful addition. So self-healing can also occur because you know we all have the power to heal ourselves we really really do um another thing i wanted to tell you guys is you know the only thing that are now obstacles in this is skepticism and very rarely irrevo irrevocable spiritual contracts i i always tell people to just do the erp energy repair protection and enhancement first be careful about ordering a whole bunch of stuff at once, because what if you have some subconscious belief problems and you don't want to spend all that money? Um, and, you know, so just baby steps. First, try that and wait a few months, then try one other service, see how that works. But don't like order like six things at once, because, uh, you know, just in case you're one of those few people, it's like four percent of people that just has even this subconscious like maybe they think yes it works but it's not going to work for me you know that kind of subconscious self-sabotaging belief can get in the way because this intense script is thought creating reality physics but if your uh thought is like i just said i don't think this is going to help me then that's going to i'm going to battle with one thought creating reality against another thought creating reality also um in my replies to you, when I tell you everything's done, um, you know, I, I say to visualize, but I think that's really important. If you want to manifest success also, just imagine yourself, for example, thin, okay? And, and all of a sudden you, you seem to be able to eat because you're, because I have things like your, the cell, uh, cellular metabolic rate is at the maximum, blah, blah, blah. So just imagine, you know, Imagine with all your senses, the smell, the sights, the uh, the experiences, um, the hearing. Oh, wow, you look so thin. What happened to you? Um, uh, oh, I'm going to go out and go to the mall. I need to get, you know, three sizes smaller, you know, throw away your fat clothes, do everything you can. Same with pain, et cetera. Insulin, I mean, diabetes. Throw, um, imagine throwing away your um, your Dexcom and your insulin and your insulin syringes and needles and all that stuff. Just kind of do that maybe a little while every day for a while imagine it's already done that you're already healed okay or that you already have financial abundance you know scratching off the lottery ticket yeah that sort of thing but anyway you can have your own ways to figure out how to manifest how to use powers of manifestation but uh, you know this is a collaborative thing we're in a partnership here where we work together to make you whole and healthy and wealthy and happy and loved with a lot of self-love. So important. Um, I think that's all I was going to say, but that's cool about the vapors, huh? I thought maybe the fire marshal was going to come around and 
kicking me out of there. But no, it was not smoke. It had no smell. All right. I love you guys. It's Friday. So I hope you guys, it's going to be out Monday. So I hope you guys had a great weekend. Bye-bye.